Hello and welcome. My name is Henrik Videgren. I'm a Swedish doctor and today I'm going to talk about science. It is important that we do clinical research so that our healthcare becomes better and evidence-based. So today I'm going to inform you about the latest study we have done at our clinic. It's called Patients Who Fall Are More Often Injured Than Those Who Do Not. And it is a classical staircase study. The background to this study is that fractures of elderly are very common. For example, one third of all 80 year old Swedish ladies have had a hip fracture. Therefore, all patients over 70 years of age undergo a fall risk assessment when they are admitted to our ward. The purpose is, of course, to prevent falling and fractures during the stay in the hospital. However, there is no scientific evidence that it is unhealthy to fall. So we made the hypothesis that older people who fall are injured. And we designed the following study. We recruited 280 patients over 70 years of age who came in for planned surgical procedures. During the stay in the hospital, we pushed the patients in different ways. And the outcomes were number of x-ray verified fractures, pain according to visual analog scale, and of course, survival. We also had a control group of 50 patients who were not pushed, and the study was randomized, double-blind, and of course, completely involuntary. And that the study was double-blind meant that the doctor who pushed the patients had blindfolds for both eyes. And the study was approved by Ethics Committee in North Korea. And the results. This figure speaks for itself. On the y-axis we have the relative risk of fracture and on the x-axis we have the pushed versus the unpushed. Thus, pushed patients have a five-fold increased risk of fracture. And this difference is very significant. Of course, we also looked on different pushing techniques. If you push with one hand, you get a three-fold increased risk of fracture with two hands, a five-fold increased risk. And if you slide tackle an elderly, you get a 12 times increased risk of fracture. These are pretty amazing numbers. It's also interesting to see in what premises you are pushing older people. A push in the corridor, three times increased risk of fracture. A push in the staircase, eight times increased risk. And if you push a person from ward number one, it's a 90 times increased risk of fracture. Ward number one is on the 12th floor. We could also observe that the increased risk of fracture was closely correlated to pain. The only exception was the push from ward number one, where no one complained of pain. So if we summarize elderly people who fall are injured. And we are proud to announce that this is new groundbreaking science and the first study of its kind in the world. We are now planning to go ahead to see if explosions near the eye can affect color vision of children. Finally, I would like to thank you for listening and I've included this last picture to emphasize that it's people we are dealing with. And it's always important that we find out how we provide the best possible health care. Thank you.